doing the TMI tag. I thought this would be a good tag to do. I'm pretty sure it's my first tag. Um, I thought it would be good to do this tag because I only have a few videos and I have I think a pretty good amount of subscribers and I just feel like you guys don't really know me that well. So I figured this would be a good first tag to do. So there's 50 questions and let's just get started because I don't want this video to be 20 minutes long. I'm wearing this floral tank top dress that I got from American Eagle. This blue flower crown, I got it from this little store called Roses where I used to live because I just recently moved. Oh, and my room is under construction right now, so this background is going to change and I will do a room tour once it's done. I'm wearing this necklace that I got from Wet Seal and this evil eye ring that I got from Wet Seal as well purple nail polish and just some pretty simple makeup. Yes, see did that. Yes, quite a few. I'm five foot three. Too much. Don't ask me that. No, but I do want a lot. <laughs> yes, I have both of my ears pierced, my nose pierced. I used to have gauges, whatever you want to call them, stretched ears. I used to have double zero um, gauges and I just let my ears shrink back down to almost normal size, which they pretty much are now. And I used to have a lip ring. I don't know if you can see the hole where it used to be. I'm gonna have to say Ezria, Ezra and Aria from Pretty Little Liars. Aria is like my girl, she's my favorite. I've loved her since of style. And I just think Ezra is so cute and I've loved their relationship from the beginning, even though he's a little sketchy now, but I still love them. I think they're so cute. I just wish they would date in real life. If they're not, if they are, let me know in the comments because I've seen pictures of them on Instagram and stuff getting all snuggly. Okay, I can't just pick one, but of course, Pretty Little Liars. I love The Walking Dead. I love American Horror Story. I'm so excited for the freak show season to come out in October. Um, I watch a lot of like adult cartoons, like The Cleveland Show, Family Guy, American Dad, a lot of those, Bob's Burgers. Most of the bands I like are like classic rock, like Led Zeppelin, The Beatles, The Doors, but like more modern like artists that I'm just gonna like throw in there. Love Lena Del Rey, obviously got this whole thing from her. I was listening to her new album, um, Ultra Violence, in the car today and it just felt so cool. I love that album. She's done it again. And I like Iggy Azalea a lot. <laughs> I miss being in high school. I think I kind of took it for granted. I graduated a year early, like on purpose because I wanted to get out so early, but now I kind of miss it. I'm about to turn 20 in like three weeks and I feel super old. I know that's not that old, but I feel old and I just really miss being in high school. Right now, I think that it's Brooklyn Baby by Lena Del Rey. I just heard it for the first time last night and I've been listening to it non-stop, so Lana Del Rey, Brooklyn Baby. Come to cool know I'm 20, I already said that, but I didn't know that question was on here. I'm a Cancer, and I have the Daily Horoscope app, and I check it every day. And I totally believe, like, we're aligned with the stars and all that. I believe it 100%. The only person you should try to be better than is the person you were yesterday. And I try to follow through with that as much as I can. It just gives me a little something to work on every day. Leonardo DiCaprio. He really, I love him. I think he's so cute and he just stole my heart in The Great Gatsby. Like he stole my heart way before that, but <sighs> Leonardo DiCaprio. I'd probably say purple, like the color of my nails. That, like a, like a 
lilac purple. This is a little bit darker than the purple that I like, but yeah, purple. Loud music. My room, or I might like take a drive somewhere. I used to like go sit at the river where I used to live, but probably just take the drive or go to my room. It takes me like 45 minutes, honestly. For me, I've wanted to join YouTube for a really long time. Like, I told my parents, like, even when I was like just starting high school, and this was like six years ago, that I wanted to be on YouTube, but I like didn't have the means to. Um, but I've wanted to be on YouTube forever. I've wanted to make beauty videos. I've just felt like it was something that I would be good at. And I know I'm not like the best at it, but I feel like it's something I could be really good at and something that I really enjoy. Also, I took in a video editing class using Final Cut Pro when I was in high school. So I already kind of have like the basic knowledge of how to edit and stuff. And also in that class, we practice like being on camera. So I'm pretty comfortable with that as well. So yeah, I just joined YouTube because I thought it would be fun to do a new way to meet people that share common interests. And I'd get to edit videos, which I really, really, really love. This is pretty funny actually. Um, I'm not scared of like the typical things people are scared of. I'm scared of a couple insects. Um, not your typical ones. Um, I'm terrified of moths, butterflies, and ladybugs. Seriously, I think they're beautiful, but I am so scared of them. Like, if one even gets anywhere close to me, I'll start falling. Tears. It freaks me out. I'm not scared of spiders or bees or anything like that. I'm not scared of flying, I'm not scared of roller coasters, I'm not scared of the dark. <sighs> don't know what it is. I'm so scared of them. I don't know. I'm sure it had something to do with my ex though, but I don't know. When I'm sad, I'm sad. I am a crier, but I haven't been that sad lately, which is good. Keep being happy. Uh, probably earlier today when I got off the phone with my mom. My YouTube name is Wildflower Beauty. Um, I actually had to make it Wildflower Beauty X because that was taken, but I checked up on it and the person who had that name doesn't even have any videos. They're not active on YouTube whatsoever, so I was like, okay. I knew that I wanted that to be my name, so. Um, basically, it's a beauty channel, so Wildflower Beauty, and um, I really like the Tom Petty song, Wildflowers, and I really like the quote, you belong among the wildflowers, and someone actually told me that once, and I just feel like, I just felt like I wanted any followers I had on my YouTube channel to be my flowers. That's why when I start a video, I say, hi flowers, and I want you all to feel like you belong among the wild flowers. Um, and I just thought that it worked so perfectly. I love floral things. I have kind of like a hippie side, and I don't know. I just, I love the name. I feel like it fits me and my channel and what I want it to be so perfectly, and I could not be happier with my life. I don't think I'll ever want to change it. I haven't really read it in a really long time. And um, I actually am setting a goal for myself to read at least one book, one book a month. I'm starting sometime soon. Because I want to do, like, add that in my favorites when I start doing favorites and stuff. And um, the last book I've read... Honestly, it's probably either The Catcher in the Rye, like aside from having to read it for school, for school because I love that book, but either that or um, The Twilight Saga, and that was like a while back. Um, and I might have read the first one, maybe two of the Hunger Games.
none. I already said that. The Cleveland show, because I watch it when I'm going to sleep, just because I don't have to pay that much attention to it, but if I am paying attention, it usually makes me laugh. My mom, I've been running errands all day and I'm in a new place and she's been giving me directions and stuff. That's my mom and she's my mom. Chipotle, not Mexican food in general, but Chipotle, it's my favorite food. I really wanna to go to the UK. I wanna live in the UK. I wanna develop a British accent, UK. But I'd also really like to go to Canada and I really realistically wanna live in California. I was at Walmart getting my brother a little game for his DS. No, <laughs> I don't have a crush. My ex. <laughs> it was a while back. I don't know, probably on YouTube in a comment or something. I don't get that many bad comments, but that probably was the last time. Like I said, I don't really associate with many people who could insult me, so. Honestly, I'm not like a big fan of sweets. I'm more like a snacker. Like I like chips and like popcorn and stuff, but sweets, I like, if I do eat like candy, I like like Kit Kats. Yeah, I like Kit Kats. A lot of you probably don't know this, and I plan on starting a music channel soon. I guess once I get more of a following. Um, but I do play guitar. Um, I started out playing ukulele, which I still can play. I just don't own one anymore. And I can also play a little bit of piano. And I think that's it. Yeah, and piano. And I sing, if that counts as an instrument, my vocal cords. I don't have very much jewelry, honestly. Um, but the only jewelry I wear every day is my nose ring. I don't ever take it out, so I'm gonna say my nose ring. I used to play softball, so softball was like, 10 years ago or something. Brooklyn Baby <laughs> by Lady Del Rey. I don't know if I have a favorite. I don't know if I even like any of them. Oh, this one's pretty funny though. Is that a mirror in your pocket? Because I can see myself in your pants. Um, no. <laughs> no, thank you. And just because I think that's funny, don't use that on me either. Yeah. Don't use any pickup lines on anyone ever. This is not like the 80s. When, when was that a popular thing? I probably hung out with my friend Nancy that I've known since I was like in the second grade. I think we went shopping or something. Probably like a month ago, maybe more, before I moved down here. Anyone who's watching this, who has a YouTube channel or wants to start one, start out with this video. Do this video. I thought it was pretty fun. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and until next time, love you guys. Bye.